So you just had a filling done and now your tooth is sensitive. What is going on? When it comes to teeth, a lot of people will think about them kind of as similar to a fingernail, toenail, not something like an organ or any other part of your body. But honestly, teeth are more like organs than you might think. They have nerves and blood vessels inside there. So anytime they're worked on, there's a possibility you could be experiencing tooth sensitivity after a procedure's done. The irritation comes from typically removing a cavity or doing other, some other type of treatment on the tooth, which irritates the nerve inside. Now this post-operative pain or sensitivity is kind of similar to if you had any other surgery on any other part of your body. For those of you who may have experienced that, usually that area is a very sensitive or tender area immediately following. You know, we really want to remember that although it's just a dentistry thing, we're also considered doctors of dental surgery or DDS. So there's still a surgery involved, even though it's on a very, very small scale. So we want to think about teeth like this as we're going into how to treat the sensitivity and how to make things get better. One of the first things we'll recommend that patients do is consider over-the-counter anti-inflammatories. That reduces any kind of inflammatory stuff going on in the tooth, so most commonly people will use Advil if they're allowed to take that, or Tylenol. These are great tools to use. If these medications are used over the course of several days in a regular fashion, most of the time the sensitivity will decrease quickly. If the sensitivity persists, the first thing we recommend is that the patient come back into the office and we just evaluate the bite on the filling and just take a look at the tooth in general. Once we've determined that additional treatment won't be needed to help your sensitivity, we often will recommend a couple of things you can do at home. The first thing is we want to make sure that we brush that area with a soft toothbrush or if we check and see if our toothbrush has a sensitive setting. In addition to that, we'll want to consider using some of the sensitivity toothpaste. These work really, really well in many cases to desensitize the teeth and they have a very lasting effect, even if used over the course of just a week or two. A common desensitizing toothpaste would be something called you know, Sensodyne or the like. So patients most often describe tooth sensitivity as discomfort when they're eating something really cold or biting down really hard onto like hard food. And it's a very short-lived feeling, but it's noticeable. It's something that they'll feel most often for the first week following the filling, and then over time it will become less often that they feel that discomfort, but it will be the same level of intensity, although it's less often in the day. Most patients will tell us that it was off and on for the first week or two following fillings and then it dissipates for good and it's gone. In rare cases, we've seen it last as much as a month, month and a half. So if you're experiencing symptoms like this right now, sit tight, use some at-home treatments like the over-the-counter pain medications and again, the toothbrushes and toothpaste that we talked about. And if the discomfort becomes more intense, happens more often over time, or lasts longer than just a few seconds, please call our office and we can evaluate you so that we can get you more comfortable. Thank you.